Grazie per i non iscritti. Thank you for the non-attached members, Mr. Steidler, for a minute and a half. Madam President, macro-regional agreements uh, uh, come from a long way back in history. Uh, so the macro region of the Danube uh, is a very old example of success and now we're talking about uh, uh, the other part of the former Danube monarchies, the Alps, is uh, talking about the same kind of thing. Uh, and there is of course a historic identity to base this on. Uh, there is, for example, the, the historic uh, country of the Tyrol, which for decades has been cooperating, including with the Trentino region. But uh, when you have these levels of macro-regional cooperation within a new uh, strategy, then they can be further improved and, and uh, uh, made denser. Uh, that is good for the defense of uh, local identity in these regions and also for their economic development. So this is a strategy that needs to be welcomed. Although, of course, uh, it will have to breathe new life into the old convention, which has been there for some time. Uh, I think this is a valuable project and, uh, and I welcome it. Thank you. Now the other speakers, starting with Mr. Dorfman for three minutes. Thank you, Madam President, Commissioner, colleagues. Europe has big 